What's up, guys? The KNH Films here, and today, uh, where am I? Oh, here we go. Um, and today we are. I'm going to show you how to farm for the rare, unique item, which is the pumpkin or the Jack O Lantern. And uh, basically, this gun it's unique only to this Halloween, and so it will not be up soon so you need to get it as soon as you see this video because this video is a little late and i'm sorry about that but basically the only boss that drops it is deadlift and you can find deadlift mainly towards the beginning of your game he is one of the first bosses you fight actually i think he's the second one that you fight and uh stupid pumpkin i believe that's it right there Guess we'll find out. Yep. Okay. So as you can see, he dropped it. It is the Jacko Cannon, and I will show you that in a minute. And obviously, he always drops this, the Fander Graffin, which is a, it's an okay gun. But um, I will show you this. What's this? Nah, that's not not that great. Um, and so basically, I have one equipped because I already had one. And basically, it shoots this big jack o' lantern. And it's very cool, and it's got a nice uh, Halloween uh, logo on the side. So I will show you that as well. But you can, basically, when all the guys, when you go to Regolith range, which is where Deadlift is, I think, is that right? Pretty sure that's right. Yeah, Regolith range, where Deadlift is. Um, if you don't see guys with pumpkin heads, deadlift won't drop it um so yeah the one i just got it is level let's see what level is it 50 okay and then we'll inspect it real quick and it's got that nice halloween logo on it and this is the straight jacko cannon but obviously the one that you will get will be some variation of the jacko cannon and uh your body lies beaten battered and broken and basically, it does explosive damage, and I will show you, but with using the one that I just got. Basically, it shoots a jack-o'-lantern, a flaming jack-o'-lantern. Now, it does not go straight. It's like kind of like a splat gun in the Borderlands 2. It, you know, has a gravi gravitational pull effects. But it is very powerful. Um, but, as you can see... You know, it's not the best gun, but it certainly is a really cool gun to have. Definitely one of my favorites in the game. It's just like the, uh, whoa, the, uh, sword explosion gun in, uh, Borderlands 2 on the Tiny Tina Assault on Dragon Keep DLC, where you get the gun that shoots a sword. So, obviously this is, like, one of the coolest guns ever, and I ho I'm hoping that they'll make, um, ones for, like, you know... Uh, the other holidays like Christmas and Thanksgiving like a giant turkey leg that shoots I don't know something um, so yeah that's about it for this video um, look forward to more tutorials and maybe a playthrough from level 1 to level 50 and I guess I will see you guys later bye